everyone, Maggie here. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm back for my Scentsy Party haul. So I closed out a party on, I think the 2nd of August maybe, so that I could use the hostess benefits on some of the fall items. So we'll start with the boring stuff first. I grabbed three 25 watt bulbs because the one that came for since Sydney's warmer broke. So I've got that. Um, I picked up one of the warmer bar bundle deals that they had where you got to pick like a three bars that were either bakery or I don't know what the other, what were the other categories? Well, anyway, I picked the one with the almond, the, the bundle that had the almond croissant in it because I've never tried that and that's what everybody talks about. So the warmer I picked up was the letterboard warmer. So I haven't even taken it out of the box yet. Um, Brad's gonna freak, he comes home and I have a new warmer set out. Set out. He is, he already thinks I have issues. That's okay. Okay, so it looks like, here is the warmer. And so this is an element warmer, I'm assuming. Yes, it's got to be. It's got to be. An, it's an element warmer. And then here are all my letters to put in my letter board. Very nice. Okay. Not sure where I'm going to put that. And then for everything else, I just put in a bunch of bars. Now you got to remember that I've been out of the Sensi game for quite a while. So some of these bars have been around a while, I think, and people really love them and I've never smelled them. So you might be like, why'd she pick those? But everything's new to me. So no random order. Um, my, the ones that I, the new ones for the fall winter catalog are in here along with the three that came with the warmer deal. So I think I remember which ones those were. So anyway, picked up a Huckleberry Hideaway, which is one of the brand new bars. Uh, Huckleberry, Mountain Violet, and Crisp White Woods. Definitely. I really like this, but I like the fruity, perfumey type of scents. And I really get, I get the fruit. I don't know that I know what a Huckleberry smells like, but I get the fruit and I definitely get the, the violet. I don't know. I like that. I do. I know a lot of the new bars haven't been getting a lot of love. Um... I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know how many of the very new ones I have in here. But anyway, I have a eucalyptus wreath, which is eucalyptus, juniper, and frosted mint. This is one of my favorites out of everything I've gotten here. And I think I'm going to throw this in my club because I love the juniper with the eucalyptus. This is really similar to several different Bath and Body candles. I'm gonna have to go through and find one to warm with, or yeah, warm with that. I grabbed salted caramel toffee, salted caramel toffee and butterscotch. I really like this one. I can really get the toffee and the butterscotch. I ooh, mm, really good on the bottom. This is quite. Uh, um, syrupy there on the bottom. It'll be interesting on warm how much I like this because sometimes to me scents like this really take over a burnt smell and I don't like them but I really like it on cold. So okay I got falling apples that's another one of the brand new ones. Crisp apple acorn and oak. Um, this is okay it's an apple scent I love apple scents I'll melt this and I'll enjoy it while it's melting. I don't think it's anything really special. I don't think it's anything that I would club, but I do think it's nice. Autumn Road Trip. I think this is the one. Harvest Apple, Andrew Pear, and Silver Oak. Okay, I love, love, love this one. I threw this one into my club. I definitely get the pear on the bottom. I really like this one. New to me, so remember that these are new to me. Another one I really liked, Fairy Tale Pumpkin. 
Harvest Pumpkin Black Raspberry Black Licorice. Uh, I do like this one a lot. I have a feeling this one will go in my club. I get all of those notes. That black licorice just does something to this scent. I really like it. Uh, let's see. That went with that. Um, cashmere and corduroy. Sandalwood. Uh, cash. I don't know how I wrote this. I put sandalwood cashmere, creamy vanilla, bergamot. Um, you know, I think this is nice. I think I'll will like it while I warm it. Um, <coughs> yeah, I think this is nice. I mean, it's not really exciting me right off the bat, but I've got to warm it and see. I don't think that's bad. Um, pumpkin roll. Let's see. Pumpkin pie filling, yellow cake, pecans, butter, spice. Um, let's see. I definitely get the spice. I can tell it's pumpkin and spice. And I might get a nutty note in there that's going to be interesting on warm to see if it smells burnt. Oh, that one goes there, and that one goes there. Okay. Uh, toasted acorn and oak. Toasted acorn, creamy chestnut, golden oak. <clears throat> I like this one, too. I definitely get the creamy chestnut. I think I like everything. I mean, yeah, this one's going to be interesting. I like this one more every time I smell it. And taking it out of the clam, I like it even more. Gonna have to look up, since I just have one bar of most of these, I'm gonna look up some mixers. I'm sure there's somewhere I can go um, online and put in scents and ask for mixing tips. Um, Autumn Sunset. This one is apples, pumpkin, fall leaves, and spices. I'm gonna take them out. I, I can't get a, I can't get a good, good sense of it. I'm not gonna be able to get this one out. Um, on cold, this one's not my favorite. I get lots of spices. I don't dislike it. Just not my favorite out of the ones, but that could all change. Definitely get a lot of spice in the leaves in with the apple. Uh, sips of cider. Blood orange, sparkling ginger, cinnamon stick. Um... You know, there's nothing wrong with this. I get a lot of the orange in this one. And a little bit of spice. And a little bit of a fizz or gingerelli type note. Not bad. Cozy cardigan. Suede blushing rose and amber silk. This is nice. To me, though, this smells like one of those... Um, one of those bars that either Better Homes and Gardens or Sensational does. A uh, cozy sweater or something cozy cashmere. Something. They have something that's really similar that we really like. Vanilla cinnamon maple. Uh, cinnamon stick buttery maple whipped sweet cream. Mm. Yeah, on this one, I'm just really getting a creamy cinnamon, maybe a little bit of maple, not as much maple as some of the other blends I've had. Frosted Vanilla, it's another one of the brand new ones, and I think this is really nice. Sweet Vanilla Bean Birch Bark Frosty Air. I love all kinds of air scents. If it's an air scent, I'm going to love it. And I really like this. Makes me ready for some snow outside, wrapping some presents. Hugging a mug. Chocolate hazelnut and cookie dough. I don't really usually like chocolate and wax. I don't know, but there's something about this. It's so warm. 
I'll probably have a hot cocoa tonight with a little bit of peppermint schnapps in it and some whipped cream on the top before I go to bed. I love doing that. Uh, I think this is nice. It'll be interesting to warm. I don't know what, what, what can I warm with this? Like maybe a vanilla bean or a sugar cookie or something. Cause I only have one unless I hold off until I have, eh, I'll probably, maybe I'll do it in my office and then one will get me a couple days worth. Fluffy fleece. Now I've never smelled this. Well, I've smelled it since I've got this, but this is the first time I've ever had this. And I think this has been around a while. Black Current Cozy Musk and Heliotrope. Mm. Um, this is okay. This isn't a must-have for me, I don't think. At least not on cold. I, from what I've been hearing from people, it's either a love or a hate relationship with this bar. It's not bad. I'll melt it. Um, Autumn Hearth. Apple Cinnamon and Tonka. This is a cinnamon apple, just like it says. What is Tonka? Let's see. Um, is Tonka a woodsy type of note? That's kind of what I'm getting. An apple cinnamon with some woodsy notes. It's not bad. Not my favorite. And Polar Bear Hug. I do think that I had this in the past. I think it would used to be called something else, somebody said. So I do think way back in the day I had this. And it's blackberry jam, caramelized brown sugar, vanilla, and amber. And I really, really like this. I really like this. So I smell... Mm -hmm. I don't know about the caramelized brown sugar, but I definitely get the amber and the blackberry jam. Okay, and then I got four bars with my warmer that came in the bundle. So I got brownie batter. Probably not going to be my favorite. It's a little too chocolatey for me. I definitely like the hug in a mug better. I got a Walmart walnut raisin muffin, which I already have a couple of these that I picked up in the flash sale or clearance sale. But this, can't smell it at all in the clam. And I think that'll be nice. I'm interested, I can't wait to warm that. I have a feeling it's gonna be a little too much for my family if I try to put it in the open concept. Uh, sugared cherry, which is cherries, grapes, pomegranates, and vanilla sugar. I like this. It's a nice cherry. I don't get a medicinal note at all. Really like that. And it's probably with the grapes and the pomegranate mixed in. And then I got almond croissant. And this is super nice. I love almond scents. You know, since it is so hard to get for us that don't have it in our clubs. I mean, is there a vendor wax that is anywhere close to this? Because, I mean, they're, the people that I watch on YouTube, I mean, they're all clubbing it, and they love it, and they'll, they'll never get rid of it. So, that leads me to think that no one's found anything close to this. I do like it. Um, only have the one bar, maybe mix it with the cherry, I don't know. I'm going to do some looking up for some mixes with these, see what I can find. So, that is my um, Scentsy Order haul. Um, probably won't do another since he order maybe until next month. I really need to take this month off from ordering. I kind of went a little crazy in June and July, but um, what are you going to do? So yeah, so everyone, thanks for stopping by and hope everyone has a good night. See ya.